nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Ignition and lift off. M1D chamber cut phenomenal. Pitching down range. T-plus 40 seconds into the mission, Falcon 9 has successfully lifted off from Space Launch Complex 40 right, at Cape Canaveral Canada. Space Force Station, carrying the NILESAT 301 satellite to a geosynchronous transfer orbit. Right now, we are throttling down the first stage engines in preparation for a period known as Max-Q. This is where we'll experience the vehicle highest amount of aerodynamic pressures on the vehicle. Max Q. Now that we've passed Max Q, we are now bringing those engines back up to full power. In about a minute, we have a couple of events happening in quick succession. Uh, first up will be main engine cutoff, also known as MECO, followed by stage separation, and then SES-1, also known as second engine start one. During uh, main engine cutoff, those nine engines will shut off. Uh, during stage separation, and the first two. and second stages will separate from one another. And then during SES-1 or second engine start one, we'll have that single Merlin vacuum engine on the second stage. It will ignite and continue to carry the NALSAT 301 satellite to its targeted drop-off orbit. Shortly after we see ignition of the second stage engine, we are expecting those fairing halves to deploy and exposing, uh, again, that NALSAT 301 satellite to the vacuum of space.